Yeah, I would have to imagine that that will be uh, heading in there. Don't think we'll see any mixes up on that side for now. We're about three seconds to go. Moyu now locking in the Nico. Bottom lane, though, trying to join in here. Sleepy Trouble Bubble on to Ben. Has to flash away now. XX in a terrible position, going way too deep. Trying to trade it back, though. Kongwe is going to be able to get out of here unscathed. But a great response by Uni Boy. Maybe they're thinking they can get a little bit more. All right, if they hit the hook. But so Knight has to push it. He wants to get the full reset. It's always that pesky spot where the lane wow. can be frozen. And the moment they threaded that trouble bubble, the inroads were massive. That's exactly what they want to do. They're going to rotate on over, but we might just have to fight the TP coming in now from the side of Top Esports. We're flashing on the Renekton, and down he will go. Flashes at the last moment as Leon a little bit too far ahead of his entire team. Wow, that was looking like a great flank from Matt team, but oh, maybe they can still get Knight. Ooh, Knight going a little bit too aggressive. I think it's there. just tough here for Matt team. Unless if Kongyo can get this going. Oh boy, Knight in a little bit of trouble, but he's trying to wow. turn it around. Look at that damage! He's just able to put Zoe Woo! in the dumpster, and he's looking for more even. One more auto could do it. Doesn't quite have the Q back available, but the 1v2 is real from Knight 9. Yeah, Not Leung doesn't have save flat. Use life. Okay, nice angle there, trying to turn that one around. Double final chapter. Who reads it better? It looks like it is going to be XX. Will lock that Rift Herald down, and now Uni Boy with nowhere to hide and nowhere to run. He just go already going to take out that CR2, oh. or one rather, and in the blink of an eye, Leon is able to flash onto him. Well, uh oh. And uh, well, we had a highlight, and now we'll have a little bit of a low light as Kung Yat just go on gap here. As now it is about 5,000. got something. XX, okay, he's going to be all alone. TP is coming in. But he's not going to be able to do much by himself. Boyu here has to flash away immediately, but nowhere for him to run. Has wow. his team behind him, but that's already two kills to Mad Team. Even Loken gets trapped up in all this business. He has to flash away as well. They still commit to it here. Mountain Drake goes down. Looking for the potential right. pick, but everything's going back out of the Zoe. As Zini Boy has to flash away, but now XX. Goes in by himself. Here comes Leon the Dominus into the back line, trying to do that AoE, but here's Knight into his own back line. Has to and is going to have the three with the help of XX. Might just be able to sweep this entire team as now Uni Boy is going to go down and it's all up to K. Maybe he can get one, no! but that is not going to look good. It might just save them. Get the zoomies here on Leon, but oh boy. Oh no. Place lock, man. That is a rune. And he's going to be dead. And here comes Knights looking for him, but the flash away from K will be good. A nice knock up as well from You're Konga. Taking he's taking the turret the entire time. They just don't care. They're going to pick up another second kill here. Will top esports as well as this game eventually. Yeah, they got a top lane wave. It seems like this is going to be it for Mad Team. I can't disagree with you. They're trying to flex on them here. Yeah, nice little read there by XX. Oh, one no. in a second one, but here comes that pop blossom. They're gonna kill the Yumi who is caught in transition. And Mad Team, they can't even get one last kill on the backside. Poor guys. They're just all gonna go down here. Uni Boy, the only one left standing, but Top Esports will be left standing for the win as the Nexus goes down. GG for game number two.